Lee Summit police tell me 21 year old Sandria Sipple was standing here in this area outside the Fairfield Inn when she was hit and killed by a vehicle. Family, of course, is devastated by the sudden loss of a loved one. My baby sister. Layla Sipple says her sister was part of a big family and family was her world. She was a mother, daughter and sibling, a bright spirit that could light up a dark room with her charm. I'm going to miss her smile, her laugh, her company, her style, everything. The crash happened just after seven Wednesday night. Lee Summit police say Sipple was sitting on the curb outside the Fairfield Inn. The driver entered the parking lot and hit Sipple pinning her against the building. Terrifying. It's terrifying for a community. It's terrifying for anyone that's walking down the street, right? That's something you know, it's your worst case scenario. Obviously a vehicle versus a pedestrian. Jackson County prosecutors say this is the woman who was behind the wheel. 23 year old Camden Hager. She's charged with driving while intoxicated, resulting in death. Sipple says common sense, not drinking and driving could have prevented her sister's death. She has a message for the driver to learn from their mistakes and teach someone else to do better. Today is Sipple's birthday. Her only wish is more time with her sweet baby sister. She is just such a free spirit and I wish she could be here for me today and I wish my birthday wasn't going so bad. I don't know what I'm going to do and I don't even think I'm going to celebrate my birthday today whatever. Prosecutors have requested a $100,000 bond. Reagan Porter, Fox 4, working for you.